A dog had three puppies. Mopsy, Topsy, and Spot. What was the mother's name? What? The flat-coated retriever is a gundog breed originating from England. It was developed as a retriever both on land and in the water. The flat-coated retriever breed standard calls for males to be 23 to 25 inches, 58 to 64 centimeters tall at the withers, with a recommended weight of 60 to 80 pounds, 27 to 36 kilograms, and for females to be 22 to 24 inches, 56 to 61 centimeters, with a recommended weight of 55 to 75 pounds, 25 to 34 kilograms. The flat-coated retriever has strong muscular jaws and a relatively long muzzle. Its head is unique to the breed and is described as being of one piece with a minimal stop and a back skull of about the same length as the muzzle. It has almond-shaped, dark brown eyes with an intelligent, friendly expression. The ears are pendant, relatively small, and lie close to the head. The occiput the bone at the back of the skull, is not to be accentuated, as it is in setters, for example, with the head flowing smoothly into a well-arched neck. The top line is strong and straight with a well-feathered tail of moderate length held straight off the back. This breed should be well-angulated front and rear, allowing for open, effortless movement. Eager and quick to learn, they are best trained in short intervals, as they may bore with repetition. The flat-coated retriever is a slow-maturing dog, as they do not reach full maturity until 3 to 5 years of age. Even then, these dogs retain their youthful, puppy-like outlook and demeanor well into old age. Patty Petch, author of The Complete Flat-Coated Retriever, refers to these dogs as the Peter Pan of the retriever breeds, given they never quite grow up. The flat-coated retriever is a natural breed and enjoys partaking in natural activities such as rolling in feces, playing in mud, and digging. These dogs are also thinking dogs, meaning they want to please but look for a way to bend the rules. This characteristic helps with their hunting ability but only if they are bonded with their owner. These dogs will work for themselves or not at all if there is no motivation to work with the handler or dog handler bond present. Most flat-coated retrievers are going to live between 13 to 14 years, but the average is 10 to 14 for most of these dogs. Flat-coated retrievers are not nearly as common as some other retrievers. It can be significantly more difficult to find them than other retrievers. Their overall costs are about what you'd expect from a larger dog. Typically, a puppy from a qualified breeder costs about $1,500 to $2,500. A good book is like a good puppy. Easy to pick up but hard to put down. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more bad jokes and general knowledge about dogs.